Hi guys Mr. Newmobile here. The Samsung Galaxy Fold 2 has finally been revealed. Please subscribe followed by the bell. You can also keep up on Facebook, Twitter by clicking the links in the description. So today we put a huge amount of the accept for the Samsung Galaxy Fold 2. The design finally revealed including a Tom Brown limited edition like photos, hardware information, the appearance of the device and the new trailer for get started though. Please like the video. If you are excited for the Galaxy Impact event. Let me know in the comments. What device you looking forward to the most what device you're watching this video on but first news of the day is new official marketing renders of the Galaxy Fold 2 and these are shared by Ishak Agarwal and my smart price on Twitter they provided us with multiple renders in both colors and gives us a great look at the upcoming smartphone we can see we got a triple camera module on the back and it's very similar to the S range. We finally get a full screen display on the front of the Galaxy Fold 2, we of course have a huge full screen display on the inside of the Fold. This is Aspects next got renders of the Galaxy Fold 2, but this time from the Ice Universe. He's provided a clear render which falls in line with exactly what is shown as shown us and he also made a comment on Whaleboat that says that the Galaxy Fold 2 come in and limited edition Tom Brown version of this limited edition, one will of course look different. It's also going to include the What 3, Titanium and the Birds Live. He then tweeted a render of what this Tom Brown version is gonna look like from this information, or expecting it to be wide up. He hasn't included any renders that show the back Nubia report, has also advised the batteries for the Galaxy Fold 2 will be produced by Samsung. They produce twin batteries for the C Photo and soon to be a 2275 million power pad with 2090. This gives a foldable phone a total capacity of 4365 million powers next. Up we finally got a live photo of the Samsung Galaxy Fold 2, and this was originally posted up by an unknown use on Twitter, but it was shared by Max, why back I have to be honest, this looks pretty legitimate, and it shows us a stunning full screen to strange at first, but it does make sense too to the internal location, we can be pretty sure now. This is exactly the phone 2 is going to look like. Of course it only a few days in to get the confirmation from Samsung. We of course have the Galaxy Fold 2 appear in the unpacked teaser, for the new launch event, the teaser focus on what we can see from the launch, and it ends with silhouettes of each device. This is of course hinting to the devices that will be included. This can be the forward to the birds live the note, what story and the Tabor 7, now that pretty much sums up all of today's new information the launches can be on 5 August, and we already know everything there is to know what the Galaxy Fold 2, the name is a bit of a mouthful, so I'm going refer to it as the phone 2 for the rest of the video we can run through the full specs in detail for any of you considering buying one. Right into it the largest room is currently floating around the web the Galaxy for 2 is can be the first device from Samsung heaven in display selfie camera. This would actually make sense given that it is a luxury device with a very high price tag. It appears it's just not going to happen, yet Credible Lika advises that Samsung are currently evaluating its feasibility for the S21. This is no way it can be ready in time for the Galaxy Phone to the outer design of the Galaxy Fold 2. It is also reported to be very similar to its predecessor, but with a larger external display, whether the whole industry has been experiencing delays due to the current outbreak, was still expecting mass production to begin mid-May commercial, units should be ready by June, when you speculating that Samsung Galaxy Photo is can be releasing alongside the Note 20 in August 2 is not too much longer until we find out. We have plenty of other concepts for the device, from people such as on leaks and concept creator, and they all look incredible. The future of falling phones is looking very promising, and the Galaxy Photo can be in a similar form, factor is the original fault, but it's going to be even more premium the patent was previously filed by Samsung, and it reveals a foldable device with a slightly different form factor than the original fold. It's more of a Galaxy tab with the following form factor, with this design we get a much large display. So this where the rumors of the in-display camera originally came from. Of course, while well in-display cameras do seem very unlikely, at this time it's not impossible, and nothing's been confirmed just yet. The early leaks came from a South Korean publication, who advised the whole design of the Galaxy Photo it was aimed at having a tablet, but with portability is reportedly can be designed to fit comfortably in pockets, but still provide a large enough display. The Galaxy Photo can supposedly be used in the form of a mini laptop, arresting the bottom, on the surface and falling up the top. We then have a display on top with the keyboard on the bottom. 
Previous reports were also stating that Samsung was switching to using ultra-thin glass instead of the transparent polyamide we'll use to in this class, was said to be capable of using an aspen now this is where the confusion originally came from, as these reports were published prior to the launch of the site, flip we had less information about ultra-thin glass. We now know that in its current form. It's not able to support an Aspen so advisor to disregard these rumors when it comes to the hardware and specific expect this to be coupled with 16 gigs of RAM and it's, of course, can use the new Snapdragon 865, will likely get some decent cameras about media, it can be the main target audience rather than photography, a device that folds out into a large tablet is great for watching media gaming or even doing some editing. But having a large device is not the best choice for portable camera department, doesn't confirm that this is the Galaxy phone to what this is ever going to make it to market, but it does seem a very sensible design that could take off. If it does we know that despite their initial issue Samsung are continuing to push the foldable devices we've already had the launch of the new W20, as well as the Samsung Galaxy Z Flip, with each release they're improving the issues they face, never coming much more durable products. Unfortunately, being a luxury product, it also means it is going to come with a luxury price tag over the price of the new Galaxy Fold 2. Is still very much unknown with the launch, expected to be July or August. It's not can be long until we do get some information as always, I'll be sharing it with you guys as it comes in, accurate about these leaks. Well having been said, please subscribe, like the video, comment thanks for watching see you on my next video one piece.